Hey guys, uh, I'm going to show you how to connect to iTunes if your iPod Touch is disabled. Mine is a uh, fourth generation. As you can see, it is already disabled. So what you want to do is hold the home button and the power button at the same time. And do that. Oh, it came undisabled, so... What you want to do is disable it real fast. Okay, it says try again in five minutes. So what you want to do is hold the power button and the home button at the same time. And that went to like that, but okay. You hold them at the same time. Keep holding them. You let go and still hold the you let go of the power button, you keep holding that. The home button, when you see that you let go and it says connect to iTunes. And if I can get a ready read of that. It shows your core. I can't really get a good view. But this right is the iTunes symbol. This little circle right here. Underneath it it says iTunes. Then here it shows an arrow and here it shows the uh, iPod USB cord going up. There's the arrow and it says iTunes and then the circle is the iTunes symbol. <clears throat> Once you got this, you need to download iTunes if you haven't already done that on your computer. Uh, you need to, um, you could sync it, back it up into your computer so you don't lose none of your data. Uh, I'll be doing a different video of how to do that. But I, right now I'm recording off my computer so it's kind of hard so yeah so okay comment like I mean not comment like I don't think of Facebook but subscribe to me uh comment uh thanks